Talking about this major earthquake, preliminary reports indicate it was a 6.4 magnitude quake. And just for perspective for all of this, those deadly quakes back in 1989 uh, and in 1994, they were 6.9 and 6.7 respectively. Sarah Seidner is live for us in Los Angeles. And Sarah, I know you've been talking to, to Brianna, but so you felt the building shake? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we, we felt the building shake, and not only that, when you looked out uh, from where we are located, this is about a 15-floor building. Uh, the entire building, you could feel it moving, uh, and you could feel some of the some of the accoutrement in here <laughs> moving as well. And then you look down at the street, and you could see the signpost going. Uh, you could see the signpost sort of moving. Uh, that is from our uh, our camera that is above us uh, on the top of this building, this 15 floor building. Uh, you see that jiggling a little bit there, but sometimes that's just wind. But we certainly felt it, and we felt it for several seconds. It wasn't sort of just a quick move and then it went away. Yeah, this went on. That's how we knew. Yeah, that's how we knew that this was definitely a, a fairly lar you know, moderately large earthquake. Uh, we are now hearing 6.4 uh, downgraded from a 6.6. .6. Uh, we have just talked to um, the renowned seismologist Lucy Jones, which a lot of people know. She has books out. She's been talking about earthquakes for uh, many, many, many decades um, and people really trust and know her. She said that just before this happened in Ridgecrest, which is about 156 Six miles from Los Angeles, there was a 4.2 just a half an hour before. So they got a they got a jolt, and then they got the larger one at 6.4. Um, and the area in the in the 1980s had a, a lot of you know 4.5 or 5. Uh, magnitude earthquake. So this is an area that is familiar, as is much of California, with with earthquakes. But this is a moderately large earthquake and can do damage. And we were able to have a conversation uh, with a hotelier that is in the Ridgecrest area. Mm -hmm. uh, that that hotel says yes. We felt the floors sort of s ripple. Um, mm -hmm. And there is damage, at least at this one hotel. And if there is damage there, there is likely damage elsewhere in the Ridgecrest area. 